Hey, Dan here again. Thanks for watching. This video covers setting up Native Instruments Complete in VIP. Now the VIP software can host virtually any VST instrument, but we're focusing on Complete now because it's a large collection of sounds, and it lets us cover some cool things about how VIP organizes your plugins. Now here we have VIP open, and all the VST instruments from Complete scanned. VIP has automatically imported all of the presets for Absinthe, Battery, FM8, and Massive. VIP includes plugin maps for all of the native instruments complete. This means you'll get automatic factory preset importing, automatic category tags, and automatic controller mappings. You can view and play your entire complete collection from the advanced controller. Now you'll notice Contact and Reactor have only one preset here. Contact loads expansion sample libraries internally, and Reactor loads what are called ensembles internally. But VIP still has plugin maps for them. Here's how to load them. Let's start with Reactor. First, select Reactor here, and then select the empty preset from the browser. To load the plugin map for an expansion, you only need to have that plugin open. Here you can see we have Reactor open to its empty default interface. So to load a plugin map, let's go up to File, Import Plugin Map for Reactor. And we want to load every feature of the plugin maps available, so be sure that the patches, tags, and controller settings box is checked. Then, click on the map file box here. This will open the VIP plugin map folder. From here you can select a single plugin map, or more than one at a time by holding the shift or control keys on your computer keyboard. We'll scroll down until we find the reactor maps. I'm just going to hold shift and click here to select all of the available reactor plugin maps. And then I'll click open. And now I'll click import. VIP will start importing all of these new plugin maps and add them to the expansion category. There are quite a few presets that come with reactor, so give VIP a little time to finish importing these if you're loading a large collection of plugins at once. Okay, so our reactor maps have finished loading. Now, we'll do the exact same process for contact. We'll select contact and its default contact preset. Once this is selected and loaded, go to File, Import Plugin Map for Contact. Click in the Map File box. Scroll down to the Contact Plugin Maps and select the ones you wish to import. Click Open, and then click Import. Like Reactor, Contact and all of the expansions that come with Complete have a lot of presets, so give VIP some time to finish loading. Okay, so we have the Native Instruments Complete Library presets all loaded in. You'll see quite a few presets have been loaded, over 16,000 with the full Complete package. And, of course, many of you will have even more once you begin adding all your other VST instruments. This is where the advanced keyboard in VIP really steps up the experience. It's very easy to take a large collection of sounds, like Complete, and find any sound quickly. Plugin maps have already been created for the entire Complete library, so all the hard work of assigning controller mappings and category tags like instrument, timbre, style, and articulation has all been done for you. Let's take a look at the advanced keyboard and start finding some sounds. We have our browser view pulled up here, with all the different categories available to look through. I'm going to look for a bass sound. So I'll start with the bass instrument, and we'll make it dark, and let's get some of that analog style. Okay, so it's narrowed this down to a pretty small list, and a uh, well, Dutch sub sounds pretty good to me. Alright, that's nice. Now I'm thinking we need an electric piano to go along with this. So I'm going to load another sound in a new slot. We'll go to the second slot here. And I'm going to remove some of the tags I selected before, because I actually know exactly what preset I want to load here. So instead of using the more descriptive category tags, I'm going to go straight to the expansions category, and I'll go right to the Scarby Vintage Keys here. 
and I'll load the Mark 1 roads. Okay, let's do a quick split with this, with the roads in the right hand and the Dutch sub in the left hand. I'll go into the multi mode and set the low key for the roads at about C3. And I'll set the high key for the sub right below that to B2. Let's take a listen. Okay, that's it. As you can see, a big VST instrument library like Complete can be organized by VIP and quickly accessed through the advanced keyboard. I hope this helps. Don't forget to check out some of our other videos, and thanks for watching.